Hello, I'm Justyna and I'm a study advisor from the IU International University. And I am here to guide you through the necessary documents you should upload in order to start your studies at our university. So, you have a copy of your study contract and you are ready to start your studies. Congratulations, you are about to give your career a major boost. There is just one more step. You need to upload your application documents so that they can be checked by our admissions team. In this video, I will show you the documents you may need to upload or send to us together with your signed study contract. You will find the link to the documents upload page in the email which we sent along with your study contract. Depending on the degree and study program you signed up for, we will need to review your application documents. We do this to make sure that you can study at the level you enrolled for. The list of required documents is included in the study contract email. If these documents were not issued for you in the English language, they will need to be translated into English. We can help you with doing that by connecting you to our trusted translation partners. Let's go over the list of potential documents to give you a clear picture of what you need and how you can share them with us. At this point, you don't have to physically send us anything. You can simply scan the documents with your phone and upload them to our upload section. Easy. Regardless of the study program you choose, you will need to upload a proof of your English language skills. This needs to be one of the official exams listed on our website under the each program's admission requirements or it can be your final exam from our free of charge speaks course, which you can take after successfully completing the course. If you have studied in English or worked in an English speaking company, you may be exempt from this. You will also need to upload a copy of your CV, your photo ID card, a passport or a national ID, and of course the signed study contract. When uploading your ID card, please black out all the fields of your ID except for first name, last name, date of birth and nationality. If you are starting a bachelor study program, you will need to apply your secondary school diploma, including your transcript of records. Make sure that all of the details in the scanned documents are easy to read, that the page fits the scan and that your name appears on the document. Here is an example of what this document should look like. If you are starting a master's study program, you will need to upload your graduate degree, including your transcript of records. Here as well, you will need to make sure that all of the details in the scanned document are easy to read, that the page fits the scan, and that your name appears on the document. Our admissions team needs all of that information when checking your application. Here is an example of what this document should look like. Some master's degree programs require having some work experience before starting the program. There are a few ways to provide a document that proves your work experience. You can upload your pay slips and your work contract, or you can download a form for your employer to fill out and then upload it. If you decide to upload your pay slips and your work contract, make sure that your name, the employer or company's name, your job title and the start date are all visible and easy to read. Please make sure to cover up any other piece of personal information that appears in your documents. Uploaded everything? Great, you are almost enrolled. Our admissions team will go over your documents and get back to you in a few days. If you are applying for non-online study models, like my studies or on campus, for example, you might need to provide additional documents. The documents will be indicated in your study contract email. Just remember, Later, you will need to send us notarized copies of your documents by mail. Here is an example of what a notarized document looks like. That's it. Best of luck with your studies at IU.